Good morning and welcome to Thought for the Day. As many of you will know, this coming Sunday marks the beginning of Advent, a time of preparation and waiting. I'm helping to lead some discussion sessions throughout Advent, the main themes being comfort and joy. If anyone would like to join us, then do please get in touch and I'll send you the Zoom link. One of our conversation starters is what practical ways can we share comfort and joy this Advent? Many people have been sharing comfort and joy in that practical sense for most of this year, whether it be collecting shopping or prescriptions or doing things online for people to enjoy. Well, I do hope that some of my thoughts may have helped bring some comfort and joy over the last few months. But there are many, many examples of people helping others. And we don't need big fancy ideas because often the simplest things are the most effective. A smile perhaps, or a phone call, or an email. They don't take much effort on our part, but they can make a big difference to someone's day. Now I could now start encouraging you all to think of new ways that you can comfort people and spread joy, which might be something that you'd like to do. But we all need to receive comfort and joy at times. Sometimes we can start thinking that we need to suffer in order to live a Christian life. We may constantly strive to do more, to give more and to be more. Now, generosity is a wonderful thing. But I believe that God doesn't want us to suffer in that generosity of time, energy or money. He wants us to experience the joy of living the Christian life. And sometimes, for that to happen, we need to be on the receiving end. We need comfort and joy brought to us. So today, you might like to think of those things that have happened over the last few months that have brought you comfort and made you feel joyful. Then spend some time thinking about them, reliving them in your mind. Because if something brightened your day once, the memory of it can bring those good feelings back to the surface. So let us pray. Heavenly Father, may we rejoice at the gift of this new day and may we find any comfort that we need. And as we receive, may we also give, knowing the comfort and joy that is God's gift to us. Amen.